point. All right, so in this video, I'm going to talk about the two-factor theory, also known as the fitness fatigue theory. Now, if you just take a look at this graph really quick, we can see that fitness is about three times as long, lasts three times as long as fatigue. But if you look here, fatigue is at a much greater magnitude than fitness. But here, yeah, I'm going to show you what it means. So, when we apply stimulus, being the workout, our fitness is going to increase. But at the same time, the longer our workout takes, our fatigue is going to increase. Now, after that workout, we're still going to have effects from that workout. Uh, we're going to be fatigued for a while. So the fatigue will continue on, continue on, but eventually it's going to wear off. But as you can see, fitness is about three times as long, as long as the duration of fatigue. So as this fatigue wears off, we have fitness left over, more than we had in the beginning. So what we can do here is take advantage of this. We have all this fitness with no fatigue. So eventually, if we wanted to continue, continue our progression, we could then apply another, another stimulus of fatigue. So fitness here, a big jump, starting from a higher base point, another fatigue applied, and now, now we're making, making progress here. Um, this is preferred now by a lot, uh, preferred over the one factor theory uh, to a lot of strength coaches now just because you don't have to time up the super compensation. You can, you can make gains without fully recovering from your workout, as you can see. Um, for example, if, here, if I race this, so if we're not fully recovered here, we still have a little bit of fatigue, but we still have this fitness. So now, fatigue increases, fitness still increases, that fatigue is just gonna overshadow Fitness. So if we went for like a four, if we had a four-week plan, we would we would have like three weeks of loading, and then our last week would be unloading to to reveal the fitness that's always been covered by the fatigue. So even though you may not be showing results of improvement in the first three weeks, that fourth week is gonna make the fatigue go away, and you're gonna get stronger. So that's it for this video.